What's up, Shredders? Today we're at the Ant Hills in Houston, Texas to check out my top 10 favorite trails and features of this unique and often underappreciated trail system. The trail builders have been busy upgrading some of the existing lines and adding new ones. This unapologetic band of rebel earth movers and woodpile wizards have crafted some of the rowdiest features in the Bayou City. It's time to adjust your saddle and buckle that helmet strap as we explore my top 10 favorite trails and features at the world famous Sand Hills in Houston, Texas. Let's check it out. Kicking off the countdown is a popular trail called Dog Pound. The upper section of Dog Pound features a beginner level pump track with small hip jumps, tables and rollers. The lower section includes an intermediate level wood drop and even larger hip jumps. Finishing up the line is a large wood berm, followed by a wood kicker gap jump. Number nine on the countdown is the Beyond Trails. To get to the Beyond Trails, you'll first need to navigate across a janky fallen tree. For those brave enough to make the journey, adventure awaits. The Beyond Trails include three challenging features. A wood drop into a steep eroded landing, a sizable gap jump called the Taint Doctor, and a large wood drop to gap landing called Drop the Mic. Try not to break a leg while shredding this remote section of trail, or you might need a rescue party to get you out. Time to shred. Number eight on the countdown today is Ant Hills 5-0. This fast flowing jump line includes a total of six medium sized gap jumps. Dropping in from the paved path will slingshot you into the line with plenty of speed. 5-0 is excellent for dialing in your jumping technique and gaining confidence on gap jump senders. This is an easy line to session, so be sure to check it out. Number seven, Space City. Try it. Space City has one of the longest gap jumps on the list. This line is also one of the shortest in the countdown. Hell yeah. What this line lacks in length, it more than makes up for in fun factor. A large step down cinder is the perfect setup for this advanced level jump.
Be sure to carry that speed and smash the boost button if you want to clear the murky muck that lies beneath. Coming in at number six on the countdown is Feel the Burb. This fun line is located on the west end of the trail system and includes three unique wood features. First in the line is a large lumber step up, followed by a rowdy shark fin berm to gap landing. Rounding out the trifecta of awesomeness is the second largest wood berm at Anthills. This fun section is worth the ride, so be sure to check it out. Number five on the countdown today is George Dingo. Named after my buddy Texas George, this line starts off with one of the most intimidating drops at the Anthills. The initial plunge requires the right speed and full commitment. Once you conjure up the cojones, it's time to dive into the line. The steep descent propels you into a fast flowing mix of hip jumps and rollers. George Dingo finishes up with a lippy tabletop that's fun to scrub. Texas G is going to tow me in. Time to shred. Coming in at number four on the countdown is Big Burn. This iconic feature is one of the largest wood structures at Ant Hills. This unique wood berm has undergone several modifications since its introduction several years ago. In February of 2021, Big Berm got a facelift and grew even bigger in size. This quirky berm has claimed its fair share of riders thanks to its unique mid-berm cinder. In the summer of 2021, the line was extended and now includes a lily pad, a whale hump, and a whale tail. Trail Captain FIFO is going to tow me into the line. Let's check it out. Sitting in the number three spot on today's countdown is Free Ride 713. This trail starts where the Big Burn line ends. As you exit the whale tail, maintain your speed and accelerate through the fence line pump track. Catch some air off the narwhal cinder, then hang a right and get ready for the grand finale. A wood kicker step down funnels you into one of my favorite cinders at the park. This iconic offset wood gap jump is perfect for cracking that whip. Trail Captain FIFO is going to lead the way. Oh, 
Occupying the number two spot in the countdown today is Shakira. This short, adrenaline-fueled line is packed with advanced level features, so show up ready to shred. Dropping in, you're greeted with a small step-down cinder before taking a wild ride on the famous Shakira wall. The fun is just getting started as you carve your way down a gully, then boost off one of the largest tip jumps at the anthills. Rounding out the line is a large wood kicker step up. Bring your A-game when shredding this crazy line. You're gonna need it. Woo! Woo! Sitting in the number one spot is Gill Six Pack. This line has had arguably the most modifications and tweaks since its debut in the summer of 2019. Dave unearthed some uh, some antique. What is that? Amy Grant. Is that a cassette tape? Is that what they call those? Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> what started out as two gully gap jumps has morphed into a six pack of crack jumps worthy of full center. Gil's Crack, as it was originally known, is the brainchild of my buddy Gilbert. This ambitious project faced many challenges, like maintaining speed and creating flow through an uphill section of trail. Strategic placement of rollers and lots of fine tuning has created one of the most shreddable jump lines at the Andes. Time to shred. If you liked this video, be sure to smash that thumbs up button and leave a comment. Be sure to check out the link in the description if you'd like to purchase any Ant Hills merchandise or donate to the trail fund. All proceeds will be used to support the trails and build more rad features. Thanks for watching today, and until next time, keep on shredding.